Hello everybody, today I'm going to be making a video of my 150 watt high pressure sodium floodlight. Okay, I'm going to open it up to show you the inside. I've already loosened the screws up along the sides so that I could get in there easier. I have two of these, 15 for 150 watt. I put that sticker on there. I know it should probably be yellow or yeah, yellow for high pressure sodium, but I didn't. I didn't care. I just wanted a sticker on there. So, okay. So, we go. And I, I have my other one. This part here is uh, has a spring thing, a spring mechanism. So when it goes about to there, it, it stops. So it's 120 volt, by the way. Here's the reflector part. The bulb sits inside of. Here's the, here's the starter. I mean, inside, here's the ballast, universal ballast, and here's the starter. I believe the starter might be universal as well, or GE. I doubt it's GE, but if it is, that'd be cool, I guess. I don't know. So I'll put this back together and light it up. Now, I'm not going to make a separate lighting video for this one because uh, it's it's a bit too easy. Since it's already wired up from the outside, I don't have to put it all together like those uh, area lights. It goes right back up, and it gets held on by, two, by a screw here and a screw on the other side. So... And it also has this little arm here that you can adjust by loosening that, and then it slides back and forth. Okay, so now I'll be lighting it up. At first it's blue, and then it turns to a yellowish color, but on camera it's white. Now it should start turning that yellowish color, or orangish color for sodium. So, now I don't, I don't know why this bulb is white, but they made it white. Or put the white stuff on the inside of the bulb. Now, the bulb is ED shaped, I believe. It has a medium base. And um, it's 150 watt. I'll move the camera so you can see it. And I'll shut this off after. So you can see the glow inside of the arc tube afterwards. It's kind of cool. I think it takes about a minute and a half or around there to get fully bright, to full brightness, because it's still getting brighter even now. Even to right now, so. Sorry about moving the camera around like that, but. Let's try to show them. I gotta move around, I gotta turn around because of the brightness, it's intense. It's very intense, it's lighting the room that I have in very, very well. Now on camera, I don't know why it's flashing like that, but now I'll shut it off so you can see the R2 glowing. That's the arc tube inside of there, glowing. It's pretty cool. 
high pressure sodium. Now, since I have two of these, I put them up on um, like two poles and directed them downwards. That's sweet. Okay, so now, now I'll turn the now I'll turn the lights back on. Thank you for watching. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. Thank.